today we'll be making chocolate spread instant one so i have taken little milk homemade ghee and uh, cocoa powder i have bought this from market the cocoa powder and sugar so ideally sugar quantity should be more if you want sweet uh, if you uh, want like a little uh, dark chocolate flavor then you can add equal quantity of sugar and cocoa powder i will add as per my requirement and a little ghee and milk for the consistency uh, i'll just show you the recipe this uh, brown sugar this is the bura sugar so it uh, melts faster and dissolve faster so i am not going to grind it if you are using normal sugar uh, or any other even this sugar also if you want to make uh, use like caster sugar what you can do is just grind it in the mixi and uh, that it will turn into white powder so that is nothing but your caster sugar which you get in the market so i'll be adding ghee into it around a big tablespoon or teaspoon then i will just keep on mixing it till it has a creamy texture and my sugar is dissolved well so this will use as a uh, replacement for cream or the condensed milk i am making it all wet i'll just show you so i'll just keep on whisking it and i'll show you the result the whisking uh, about 2 minutes uh, now it is getting little thicker and color will turn little lighter you can use uh, cream or uh, milk uh, also and uh, like condensed milk and you can use butter also instead of ghee and uh, cream so since i don't have cream i'll be using milk and this so as you can see where i have stirred it is getting little lighter in color and i'll show you the result again link uh, now almost uh, the syrup is come and see if you like you can see this is the syrup like consistency falling so uh, in this time uh, like uh, instead of just uh, mixing it like this only with ghee and sugar i will add cocoa powder also little butter and milk little milk and i will mix it added uh, half kettori of cocoa powder and a half of milk uh, to the sugar and ghee mixture and still my sugar was not completely dissolved but i will mix uh, because i am very much confident that it will get dissolved with this so i to do it in a shortcut way i'll mix it together for some time and see so this is my ghee sugar milk and cocoa powder ghee is little sugar and cocoa powder are in the 1 is to 2 ratio half of cocoa powder twice of sugar you can make to 1 is to 1 also if you want and milk i have just added half uh, half of uh, sugar only so the color you can see is the dark chocolate now since the sugar is almost dissolved i'll be stirring it i have just put this on gas so the sugar syrup will thicken and that is the reason i didn't uh, grind it because it will get dissolved and i'm keeping stirring it take care the flame is low not much high keep on mixing in one direction you can also microwave this uh, mixture for 10 seconds then remove it and then whisk it the milk will get heated and uh, the uh, boiled milk also you can add see the consistency is like liquid syrup it will get thickened as and when we heat and keep on stirring it i 
I like little dark chocolate flavor. So more cocoa powder. So you can see on sides it is a dairy and getting thick. A bit thick now. don't have whisker you can use that silicone spatula which you use for cake so this is mixed properly as you can see on this like this it will be little thick there is a very nice chocolate smell coming out of it very tempting it is boiling kind of thing it is becoming thicker and thicker the mixture because of fumes in an acid one spoon so when it is equal quantity for cocoa powder and sugar this will be like a little thick uh, like chocolate cream which we use for garnishing or making flowers on the cake and all it is half the quantity it can be used as chocolate ganache for uh, just pouring it the thick syrup pouring as uh, chocolate pouring on the cake for giving it a bright color and what we are making is the chocolate spread so when it is hot it will be little viscous more viscous it will be when we cool it I heat for more five minutes at least but I'll keep on stirring take care that you keep on stirring it just getting thick mixture is coming to boiling you can uh, like people add uh, maida uh, to thicken it or cream since I don't have any and I want to make it little healthy so I have to heat little more well it will be same tastier spread so see how the ganache is ready like uh, uh, just to show you it has become thick and shiny at this point you can add little ghee for the shine and a pinch of salt which is optional it will enhance the taste but I will not add it so our chocolate ganache is ready at this point I'll be switching off my gas and keep on stirring it you can see the bubble and viscous chocolate syrup ready okay so at this consistency you can switch off the gas for ganache for making spread a little more uh, heat will require so we'll keep on mixing it more if you just needed a ganache then you can stop at the previous time this is the perfect ganache consistency the flowing syrup uh, you can just pour this on the cake when the cake is hot and your chocolate cake ganache will be ready so as you can see now our uh, gana stage is gone and i was heating it more so now it is the perfect consistency this is more viscous to make it as a spread so now i'll switch off my gas for the spread and then uh, let it cool and our perfect viscous spread chocolate spread will be ready now it's not that pouring consistency it is giving the dark color and after cooling it will be the perfect spread so our chocolate spread is kind of ready after cooling it will be done
so see how thick it is now sticky so this is the consistency of the chocolate spread like jam and it is really viscous so now after cooling okay, so i'll just pour it in the bowl to show you the pouring consistency and let it cool the others in uh, the same container so after cooling it will be more thick so i'll just transfer in the bowl and show it to you you can see the thick viscous syrup very nice and it's really yummy so my silky creamy chocolate spread is ready you can see the ribbon consistency this is the perfect consistency of the spread 